Dynamics GP 2015 now includes the feature to take smart lists that were developed with smart list designer and publish those to refreshable Excel reports. This is a great feature. It's going to allow you to take better advantage of refreshable Excel reports. So let's get started. They've also changed the navigation just a little bit. So the first thing I want to do is go into Smart List Designer. If I go to the Administration tab, it's down here. It's also available from the standard menu. To get Smart List Designer reports that are publishable to refreshable Excel reports, you need to use a SQL view as your basis for the report. So SQL views, there's a lot of them are available in Dynamics GP just out of the box. There's also a lot available on the web. You can find those if you do the search and you can also create your own. So what I wanna do for this exercise, is I'm gonna create a new smart list based on a SQL view that I got from Victoria Uden's site. So let's take a look at that. Here's the smart list designer application. I'm gonna create a new one. I'm gonna name it current AP aging. And this is going to look at a SQL view from Victoria. It's going to show me detailed aging for outstanding accounts payable invoices. So I'm going to name it here. I'm going to also show it in the purchasing area. And then I'm going to find the view that I want. These are all products and there are tables there. But then I've got a list of views down here. And these are standard views that come with the system. But also, you can create your own views. And I created this one based on information from Victoria's site. So let's take a look at that. Here's a view right here that I want to include in my smart list. So I'm just going to check that. It brings all the fields over into the selected fields area. And there aren't too many fields on this view, so I'm just going to select all of them. Then I can just run the query to see what the results are going to be. And you can see the results down here at the bottom. Looks good to me, so I'm just going to hit OK. Now that becomes part of my smart list. So if I go back into smart list, I'll see that as an option now. I put that under purchasing. So let's take a look at that. I've got my current aging here. So this is the one that I just created. So again, this is a smart list that I created in smart list designer based on a view, SQL view. And I'm going to publish it to refreshable Excel reports. So let's click on publish. And it's that easy. So let's go into refreshable Excel reports and we'll take a look at it there. And I'm going to go into the purchasing area and look at the list there and click on Excel reports. And I get all the Excel reports in the purchasing area. Here's the one that I just created. Let's run it. And there it is, my new refreshable Excel report based on the SQL query that I included in my Smart List Designer report. You can see that the data connection has been created. And now I can use this Excel report as a basis for reusable reports. I can use it in dashboards any way that I want. I can always refresh it by refreshing the data from GP. So this is an easy way to get data out of GP and make great use of it.